everybody! My name is Tyler Oakley. Hey, what's up you guys? Hello there everyone. Greetings everyone! Well, hello everyone. My name is Tyler Oakley, and for the last eight years, I have shared the real me with the world. Oh my god, I feel myself blushing. There's a lot I need to tell you guys. Me being me may have even helped some of you guys be you. I have one hand that is very different. I'm proud to say that I have bigger body than most girls. I'm a huge fan of romantic comedies. It is crazy what is possible when you are unafraid to be you. I love y'all. Well, hello there. So, I hope you guys enjoyed my music video, Don't Wait. This video has so much meaning and is really, really special to me. I'm gay, <laughs> and um, I did it in the music video in a way that was um, not officially saying it, because in a way I think it's um, not necessary to have to say who you are and do like a, a video just talking about your sexuality because my life is so much more than that. God, I am already living for everything you're thinking about doing. Well, here's the thing. Bloody Mary is from Born This Way and Venus is from Art Pop. So it really depends on what era you want to represent of Gaga. I mean, I'm surprised you're not going the cheek to cheek route because I feel like that could offer some good drag moments. But, if I had to decide, I might go with Venus. But either way, whatever you do, let me know and send me a video because Daddy wants to see that. It's like you've been laying in that tanning bed for 10 hours, you fried chicken. <laughs> Don't worry, bitch, chicken's healthy. Today on the show, I have a very special guest. Hello, fellow citizens. Yo, 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 welcome back to the G-Spot with me, SDZ. Uh, 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 oh, keep on dancing till the world ends. Pyrotechnics! Have six bags of fries from different restaurants. Oh, that's exactly like childhood. Actually, no, this is nothing like childhood. I wish this is what my childhood was like. My mom would never take me through six different drive throughs She wouldn't even take me through one. She made me walk in, you know, for the exercise. And I'm making this video because I feel like it can help a lot of people. Um, this is just one little small glimpse into what you will get in my book in real life, which comes out on this upcoming Tuesday, and I really just hope that it will be able to help some of you guys out there going through similar struggles that I went through, and um, can do some good. Your mom totally knows. Why don't you just tell her? FYI, I like guys. She's so smug, dropping her little hints. I'm not gonna give her the satisfaction. Hey, you boys have any poppers? Popper would really hit the spot right about now. Explain this to me again. How will being the first out kid in school make you instantly popular? It's simple. The hottest new trend sweeping schools worldwide is the GBF. It stands for- I know what it stands for. Gay best friend. My future GBF is just waiting to come out of the closet and tell me how fierce I am. And pretty soon, all three prom queen frontrunners will be battling it out for my attention. Boom! I just want- Are my arms looking Michelle Obama toned or Madonna scary? Ashley's Mormon. They smile to your face and probably eat you in the back. My well, I can't help it that the school is devoid of the gay. I mean, if there were some, they worship me. Why not send out a mass text and be done with it? You can't or you cannot come out via text. All I wanna get is... I guess I am. Gay, I'm gay, I guess. <gasps> Our very own homosexual! <laughs> you don't even sound like the ones on Bravo. We can totally gay you over. It seems that many of you girls are treating Tan as more of a prize to be won than an actual person. Maybe everyone secretly wants a GBF. Come on, 
on. You call this an ensemble? Get it together, girl. Do not call me that. I meant like girl with a U. Girl. Think you're doing? I'm just talking to Kev about something. Get out there and find a gay or a lesbian right now. I don't want the wrong impression. Yeah, right. Because you're so bloody irresistible. When you're in a battle against an enemy so much bigger, so much stronger than you, to find out you had a friend you never knew existed, well, that's the best feeling in the world. My, I play the character of Steph. Steph is a northern lesbian who's um, moved to London to escape um, a family life that didn't really accept what she was about and her sexual orientation. Um, and she's about 23 years old um, and she moves to London and she starts kicking it with these, with these guys in this group that ends up becoming LGSM and, um, and yeah, she, she's the only girl originally in the LGSM when it first starts. So LGSM um, is a group, it's called Lesbians and Gays Support the Minors um, and it was first started by um, the character Mark um, who is, sees that these minors are being treated the same way essentially that the gay community has been treated, you know, there's the police brutality, no one's listening to them, no one believes in their cause and he just he just gets up one day and he's just like, look, we need to do something. So in that group we've got Mark, we've got Jeff, we've got Reggie and Ray, we've got Mike, we've got Joe, who, who eventually comes into it and then you've got Steph. Um, and yeah, they're, they're about raising money to help these this mining community in Wales. Um, and go over and meet them and 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 that kind of that story about them kind of being accepted by the Welsh miners as well you know this group of gays just turn up with a lot of money for them and it's like what what um yeah and it's it's kind of it, it's their journey that's that group is is about raising money for the miners and how they go about that you know